Welcome to VAT19 Rejects, the show where we dumpster dive through the internet's weirdest products. We rejected the old set, moved into this nice new rejected place. Jamie's already rejected these products. But Eric and I are gonna decide if he was right. I'm always right. Here we go, okay. This is the TV pillow remote. Check it out. Right away, I think you were wrong. Press the buttons. Oh, that's a nice tactile. Oh, that's a good button. They're so satisfying. So you can't to press. put your head on it. They have technology that prevents errant head really? presses. The side effect is that it just doesn't work at all. None of the buttons work on uh, any TV we tried. We couldn't get it to work. Did you put batteries in it? Yes, we put batteries in it. There are batteries in it, right? I can't get enough of these buttons. If only they worked, Ben. Here, watch out! Guys, 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 guys. You wouldn't think we'd pull out a big brand like yeah. M&M. We usually punch down. These are bubblegum flavored M&Ms. Oh, so there's no bubblegum in them? No, they're just flavored. That's so weird. Why are you getting more? Because I'm fascinated at that. It's very Eastery. I can warm up to that. You just like any food. No. That's fair. I am kind of like the office possum. We'll like flick on the lights of the board and get Eric will like <laughs> scurry yeah, away. They have, to, they have to cover all the trash cans. This bag will stay full for the end of time. We'll see about that. I don't even want to talk about this thing. This is the butt putt golf game. You guys deal with it. Oh, the number two hole. Clever. It has six different gassy sounds, guys. Okay, that was a big one. Not a lot of bass. Let's say you're playing and uh, it goes in. It doesn't come back to you. I feel like these guys have never played golf ever. And even in real life, when you eat food, it comes back to you. Can someone catch this? Oh! Get ready for some real science. This is the magical spinning top that spins for hours. <gasps> cool. Cool spinning top here. Very fancy. This is giving me Inception vibes. Kind of cool. How does it work? I mean, is it just a, a good top? No. There's a battery inside of it. Really? Yeah, and electronics. That's dope, dude! What? No! That's not dope, dude! It's like a magic trick! I'm with Eric on this. I think it looks cool. It's like a little decoration. It's sort of like you wink to the camera and say, that's my secret. <gasps> Whoa! I'm sorry, Jamie, I love it. Yes! You love it? Brendan's on board! Dylan, are you on board? Maybe we gotta get this limbo top up on the site, you know? I've been known to be wrong. I'm always right. Maybe it's one to reconsider. Hey, yeah, top trick! Yeah, that's dope, dude. Oh! This is probably the most ridiculous product I've ever come across. Oh, that's saying a lot. Send it in. This is a tongue for licking your cat. Oh, no. I've got the not a cat cat here. You can. Wait, why? Hmm, I think it likes it. Can you imagine trying to do this to a real cat? Do they think that cats miss having a face near them? A human face. This cat can't give me any feedback. Get out over here, Ben. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No. I didn't like it? Yeah, I didn't care for it. Get Jamie, see what he thinks. Yeah. It's harder than it should be, yeah. but I guess cats are. We could test it on a pet. Somebody say grooming? A little too close. You kind of smell like the bottom of a garbage can. <laughs> oh! Again! Again! Woo! Yes, yes, yes! Yeah! I loved it. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Oh, you want to try it? <laughs> oh, all right. Oh, you have a lighter touch than Eric did. I'm starting to gnaw. Starting to gnaw. <laughs> Boglin loved it. This thing's rejected. It's coming in. Oh, you know what? I want you to figure out what it is. I mean, it's obviously a nose. Uh -huh. What does it do, Eric? It's got suction cups on the back. Oh, I got, I got something on me. This is a shower gel dispenser. Oh, that's fun. So you put it on your shower wall. Yeah, you squeeze the nose. Oh, that's so gross. Kids would love this. I find it hard to press. I'm worried the kid's gonna have a hard time. I could see this being like the soap dispenser in the bathroom at a kid's museum or something. I'm still a no, because I think it's too hard. You're a nose. It's gonna be a nose for me, dog. Oh, here we go. Oh boy. This is the light therapy face mask. Close your eyes. Open your eyes. 
Ah! Oh my god. Why is it so wide? It uses all these LED lights in here. It's de-aging me. <laughs> Super comfortable. Yeah. You sort of look like the killer from Hush. How is this supposed to do stuff? You know, lights hit your skin and you get more beautiful. Oh, it really squeezes yeah. your eyeballs. You know, they say the International Medical Organization confirmed the use of specific wavelengths of light close exposure marking here for my Balance water and oil ratio, not a thing. Effectively relieve mental tension. No, it won't. Eric, how's your mental tension? It's tight right now. I don't mean to get too uh, technical on everyone, but all of these colors of light are present in regular sunlight. Whatever this thing could do, just go outside. It'd be a good Halloween thing. If it didn't dig into your eyes so much. Oh, Eric, you're gonna love this. This is Nake Fit. They're disposable shoes just for the bottoms of your feet. Why not a sandal? Because sandals aren't disposable. This <laughs> the child size. Uh, this might be a bit small. How's it feel? It feels like I have a sticker on my foot. I stepped on something and I'm like, <laughs> oh no. It does feel like my foot's more protected. I don't get it at all. Walking barefoot is fun because you feel like the texture and like the sand can be really satisfying. Oh. And then it feels like you got something stuck to your foot. Reject it. Oh, I love oh, oh. tentacles. <laughs> oh. Ow. You guys ready for this? The boxing reflex ball. Do you want to demonstrate it, Eric? I'll try. Oh no. Start punching that ball. Go! 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 Kyle boxes, do you think he can do this? Oh. <laughs> Let's get Kyle in here. All right, we're bringing in our resident boxer, Kyle. Disgusting. I can just go. Come on! Come on! Get out of there! Oh, yeah. Ah! All right. Oh, yeah. wow. It's fun to watch. Finish him. Oh! oh. Right, give it a try. No, I'm good. Right, thanks for coming in, Kyle. Thanks, Kyle. Good job, Kyle. Watch out! Now, don't just instantly yeah. say yes because you see food. This is the Biker Chick beer can chicken stand. It's this whole metal thing that looks like a motorcycle. Presumably to cook a beer can chicken, which is like a common thing people make. Oh, <laughs> ride, baby, ride! You throw that whole contraption on your grill, and then when your buddies come over, you're like, hey, Eric, check this out. It is kind of clever, though. Why don't you like this, Jamie? This seems right up our alley. I guess I just didn't think that there were that many people shoving beer cans up the rear end of chickens. Of There's a whole community of us. Okay. But I've got a friend who would love to cruise on this thing. Gee, I wonder who your friend is. Let's ride! Woo! Oh, he's just smearing <laughs> chicken all over the Woo! table. Oh, God, it's breaking up! Ah! Oh. All right, guys, it's time for the rapid rejects. Yeah, 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 yeah. Put 60 seconds on the clock, Eric. And reject! This is duct tape that's what? scented, what? supposed to smell like lemon, doesn't. A little bit. This is a food separator. You put this on your plate to keep food from touching what? itself. What? It's a vitamin it's tray. A ah! It's a ball of worms. It's $50. No. $50? This is a desktop confession. 35 oh. seconds left. So you can go in and, and confess this little thing on that's your desktop. Not, that's not how it works. Does that count? That feels like it wouldn't count. You're going to hell. This is a pickle air freshener. Yes. Smell it. Oh, I did my. <laughs> and then this is just a gag gift. It's just nothing. It's just no, a plastic thing. Air? Yeah. And that's it's, trash. It's $21. And that's time. Thank you. This is a new segment called Are We or Aren't We? I've got three products, one of which we're selling, the other two we're not. Can you figure out which one we are selling? How well do we know that 19? Let's bring in the first product. Check this out, folks. A chicken tender keychain. It's kitschy, it's kind of fun, I could see it. We have a lot of keychains. Throw this in. This is a hollow chocolate football. Okay. We do love our big candy. Although, I feel like Jamie doesn't like hollow things. I do want to throw this. I do want to eat it. <laughs> That's pretty legit. I would not have guessed this was chocolate. Okay, right here. Tight spiral. Oh, jeez! <laughs> oh, look at that. Okay. That's pretty solid chocolate. Final product. This is the world's smallest table tennis set. This is the most on brand so far. <laughs> it's dead and... <laughs> Yeah! Dominated! I wanted the ball to bounce more. Man, this is tough. Time to make a decision. Is it the chicken keychain, the chocolate football, or the world's smallest table tennis? 
I feel like this is most on brand, but I don't know if the quality was there. I'm just gonna go with what I wanna see us carry. I'm going to the Ohio State University. <laughs> I'm with Eric. I think this is the coolest one, so I think that's what it is. Did we get it right? The answer is yes! Yeah! We are selling that. Yeah! No, <laughs> I knew it. Touchdown! Floor chocolate! All right, that's our show, bye! Vat19.com